In Office 365, OneDrive is the place to store and access your files. You can create folders and organize your files as well. For example, I might want a folder for this school year. I select New, Folder, and then give it a name, such as 2020-2021. Then Create. When I select that folder to open it, I now can create new files in this folder or I can upload from my computer or my device. To navigate back to your OneDrive, you can either click OneDrive from the top left corner or you can use the navigation. For example, I'll go back one step to my files. I have a document I need to move into my new folder, Letter to My Teacher. There are a number of ways of moving this. To the left of the item, if I click the circle to select it, the toolbar at the top will change. One of my options is Move. If I select Move to, on the right hand side it opens a panel where I can select my OneDrive, then my folder 2021, and move here. It will take that item and move it into the folder. You can also use the three dots next to an item to do something similar. From the three dots, you'll have a drop down menu with lots of options. Move to is available there as well. When you're inside your folder, you also have that new menu where you can create a new Word document, Excel workbook, PowerPoint presentation, OneNote notebook, or even forms for Excel. If you create a new link, you can paste a link to a web page or a file that you have from somewhere else. Need some help? Check out the question mark in the upper right hand corner. If you want to navigate back to your Office 365 homepage, use the waffle in the upper left hand corner and select Office 365. Otherwise, you can navigate to another app right from your waffle. If your student needs technical assistance, please email studenthelp at tacoma.k12.wa.us.